Okay, we are live recording Timothy's raindrop procedure. Ready, Dr. Tyson? Yes, as a matter of fact, I am. I am ready to go. We're very excited because we're going to be doing some, another raindrop procedure today. And so far they've been all fabulous, so I'm really excited. We're excited too. <laughs> So now we made the flap, and now we're going to put the raindrop underneath the flap. That's the next part. step. Six 
seconds. Four, three, two, one. Just a little wetness here. Keep focusing on the light, please. Okay, so now we're ready to put the raindrop inlay on the surface of the cornea underneath the flap we just created. Great. So just wait for that raindrop to dry onto the surface. Okay, so then we're going to put that flat back on there. Can get a, another wet foot?
going to stay on the lunar surface or be Good, bro. Thank you. Four drive home. Awesome job, Dr. T. Uh, yeah, Tim did great. <laughs> That teddy bear yes. helped you then. Yeah, calmed you right down. You were awesome. Good. Yeah. Told you you'd be okay. It didn't hurt. Told you. <laughs> he, he got all very <laughs> Told you. Uh, <laughs> only part that bothered me a little bit was having the patch yes. over this eye because I guess the drops were in there and it was like a little itchy like. Mm -hmm. But this eye, while they were working on it, it looked like you were looking at the thing on the twilight zone. <laughs> do, 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 do. It was awesome. It didn't hurt or nothing. Oh, okay. 
Well, here, you gotta go get your goodies. Yeah, you can come this one. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Great job, guys. Yeah, that's what I mean. Let's take a look. Let's show those golden locks to everybody. Uh oh, now I can see some women's clothes. Oh, no. <laughs> you would. He said he's going to be there. <laughs> 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 Diana, guys. Mm -hmm. Dr. Tyson's the man, the man with the plan. <laughs> No, I think we'll just get some drops and I think we're good to go. Okay. Right. You want somebody to do that? Somebody do that? Sure. We got a room full of people. <laughs> yeah. I know, it's a party in here. No pressure. Go Somebody's got to do the drops. See, the cap comes off. There you go. Can I stick it in? All right, Tim, so I'll see you tomorrow. Yep. Thank you very much. Good job, bud. All right. Good stuff, All right. All right. No problem. You did great. Yep. All right. Hurry with his love today. And he's gonna have um, that little calendar, so you'll know, you'll know, you know exactly when to take the drops, how many times to take them. There's little check boxes in there, Very so good. you'll be good to go. I'm going to give you this tissue just okay, in case if you, you feel it dripping, just that right. underneath, not on your eye, okay? okay. All right, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we have your post-op appointment tomorrow morning at 1020. Yep. Yes, we do. And Dr. Tyson's home number is here if you have any problems. Okay. You can see this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the schedule for the drops is on this first page here. Okay. Well, the X's. Okay. Okay. And then you 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 have the drops at home, right? Yep. Okay. So she put one dose of each drop in okay. just now. So do three more before you actually go to bed tonight. Okay. Okay. And then the most important thing is to keep your eyes closed for four hours. Right. Okay. okay. You know, if something ha you know, things happen. Right. So if you have to open them once or twice. For whatever reason, that's fine. But the cells start growing the minute you close your eye. Right, okay. That's when you open them again, then it starts all over. Um, so if they advise no heavy reading or computer work the first day, you can watch TV, increase activity as your comfort and your vision allows. Okay, take your normal over the pain, over the counter pain medications if you need them. Okay. Most people don't. They just say that they have an irritating feeling in them. Right, okay. Okay, you might notice some tearing, burning, stinging, light sensitivity, redness, foreign body sensation. If you notice a sudden pain or sudden decrease in vision, that's when you need to call Dr. Tyson. Okay. Okay? The things that you might experience over the next week or so, you might have periods of foggy vision, like not a whole day with foggy right, right. vision. But your vision is going to stabilize over the next week or two as your eye heals. Okay. Okay, you might have some um, halos, glare, starbursts. So the things to avoid, don't get soap or water in your eyes while showering. In the kit that we're going to give you are some goggles that are intended to wear at night so you don't poke yourself in the eye while you're sleeping. But a lot of my patients tell me that they like to wear them in the shower because then the soap runs off instead of in their eye. So you can do that if you want. There are also some tears in here. 
anytime you have eye surgery, um, your eyes get really dry. So in addition to the other drops, you can use these. But space each drop five minutes apart. So you're going to do the first drop, wait five minutes, do the second drop, wait five minutes, and then if you want to do these, wait, you know. Okay. That way they're not washing each other out. Right, right, right. So the only other thing is no swimming scuba diving or hot tubs for two weeks and no contact sports for two weeks. Okay. You don't want anything to accidentally right, poke you in the eye. eye. Mm -hmm. Now, no, unless with, my, with my job that I have, um, I bought these safety goggles that got like a strap on them mm -hmm. because I work on heaters, a lot of soot, you know, yes. dark smoke. So, when I go back to work tomorrow or the next day, I'm going to wear them Definitely. when I'm doing the jugs. I don't want smoke getting in my eyes. When right. smoke gets in your eyes, they, your eyes get itchy. Water, yep, and then you're going to want to rub them. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll ask, we can ask Dr. Jason and see how often, how long he wants you to wear them. Right. You know, like if it's a week or two weeks or, right. healing, you know, whatever. But like she said, the, the, um, the schedule for the drops is here too. Okay. So if you want to just check off... You know, I've used it twice today, and right. I'm using it, you know, each time you use it, then you can just check it off, you know. Okay. How many times did I use it today? Okay, now, he's got to keep his eye closed for four hours, right? How do you want us to put the drops in before he goes to bed? Well, then? you can, I mean, even if you, if he goes home and closes his eyes for four hours, it's quite often, so like, It'll be seven o'clock. So you know, even if you have to do them every hour, hour and a half. Okay. And you're gonna do three Okay. Minutes, I just wanted just to make sure you do it with that. Yeah. He likes okay. you to do that the first day. Just okay. That's just to fine. get them all in. That's fine. Now, let me ask him about the safety goggles. Wait a minute. Okay. Well, Kathy's gonna finish up with you. She's gonna give you your gift. So. Um, overall, you feel good. Yeah, so we'll I see you good. for your next post-op appointment tomorrow. Yeah. And. Yeah, I think that's it. Thank you so much for being our first Raindrop Facebook Live. <laughs> Didn't hurt. So anybody out there, it did not hurt. And I'm a chicken, so. <laughs> okay. Okay. Goodbye.